Check out Chaos Cards for awesome prices and products. Ruth here, and it has been quite a while since I did a uh, Chaos Cards haul video. Because, uh, like, I just, you know, either ordered little bits or not thingy, but this I had to do because, I mean, look how big this box is. I mean, yeah. Ah, laundry basket falling over. Okay. So I, I just had to, you know. Um, the, the bigness of this box is... Yeah, I just had to. So, technically since today is the 16th, I think, the Pikachu and Easy merch has been released uh, now. And I did pre-order. So. Uh, just a little bit. So we have packaging. On packaging. On packaging. So I can easily, like, you know, wrap parcels in this or something. Holy moly, we got styrofoam too! Look at that. Okay, so... Ooh, this is gonna be nice. <laughs> oh, wow. This, this, this is a lot. I mean, if I move the camera back a bit, look, this is... This is just mountains and... Mountains and... Yeah. Well, uh, A star for packaging. Okay. Ooh, we've even got these double things. Okay. Hopefully, I can make sure I don't get any styrofoam bits on the floor. So just shove this without walking over anything like a frog. Okay, so. Sneaky. Okay, so what we have is awesomeness all around. Oh, I know that's why the box is so big. It's because of the Yu-Gi-Oh! advent calendar. I forgot how big that thing was. Because uh, I watched a, a Cyber Knight's uh, opening of it. Um, and yeah. It is quite a bit of Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff. Okay, so let's just go for the first thing that was Underneath. Oh, this box is pretty big too. Oh, wow, it comes with the playmat. Yes! I actually didn't notice before when I watched someone's unboxing of this because I actually wasn't paying too much attention. <laughs> but, um, this is the Island Guardians GX Premium Collection. So it features Tapu Fini and Tapu Lele. Um, alternate arts, yes, maybe? I think so. Yeah. I mean, look at them. Look cute. I mean, Papu Lele is winking. And I'm still waiting on that Tapu Lele pin collection box that seems to have not released yet. But I bought two of those. I think I said ages ago. But, um, yes. So it's got a jumbo and pin, uh, coin, but I guess no pin, maybe? I can't really tell, but it doesn't view a pin anywhere, which sucks, because, like, I want a pin. Did they not do pins for this European version? Because I think they did a pin for the US version, which totally double standard there, Pokemon, really. But, I love the playmat. At least it has a playmat. Yeah. See? If you can see, it's not blurred out. The playmat is awesome! I love the playmat. At least it has a playmat. Because obviously, the Shining Legends one had a poster, not a playmat. Which I'm still peeved about, and I still need to laminate. I haven't gotten around to get down to the library to laminate it yet. 
um, Tapu Lele and Tapu Fini uh, promo, technically alternate arts. A uh, colorful playmat featuring La Flora and the Guardians. Eight Pokemon TCG booster packs, which is awesome. There's eight in there. Tapu Lele coin. Didn't they put a Tapu Fini coin in the US one? Or I'm just thinking something, because I watched a Will Breaking Nate's video of this, I think. It was this one anyway. I can't remember now. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, I thought it was a Tapu Fini coin for their one. Who knows? And a code card. That was a little obviously there are code cards in each of the packs. Uh, anyway, this box is cute. And it's awesome. Well, hey. So that, that's that one. So on to like one of the main main things here is this. And it is awesome that it includes the figure because like total double standards if there is no figure. I mean that's like half like half of the box. Okay, if you see this, this is the Pikachu and Eevee Pokeball collection. And it's also pretty cool the Pokeball's a tin that can hold a 60 card deck. So obviously you got the promos, Pikachu and Eevee. Z pin is uh, not pin, the figure. <laughs> and the box is cool. Like obviously the box is a big to keep anyway, but it has good enough pictures on the side that I can cut out and stick in my Pokemon scrapbook. Two great friends ready to go. I'm not gonna read it out because I'll I'll do that when I open this thing. But it's got one figure of Pikachu and Eevee playing together. You see that? Uh, two never before seen photo promo cards featuring Pikachu and Eevee. Pokeball big enough to hold a stack of Pokemon TCG cards. Which actually it says up here anyway. So that holds up to 60 Pokemon TCG cards, which is basically a deck. I think it's a deck anyway. I've never actually had to make one myself. Um, five booster packs and a code card. I'm not sure what the code card holds. It's either a deck or the promos and a deck, or just the promos. I'll have to see because most likely the the codes actually. Have a name on them, so they'll tell you. Yes. So it looks like we got Lost Thunder, which I actually haven't opened any Lost Thunder yet. Um, I, I bought this first before any Lost Thunder stuff, because Pikachu and Eevee has the priority here. See, so and then we got, I guess, two Lost Thunder, a Celestial Storm, Burning Shadows, maybe. And a steam siege? I'm not very good at really telling by the pack art there, but it's been a while. Okay, so that is that awesomeness. Now, if I can stretch all the way over here, I can get the other one. So let's just... <sighs> Come on. My arms aren't that long, so... It probably can't actually reach up. So let me just move... Yes. Okay, no, it's sliding. Don't slide away from me, come on. Okay, let me take these out. So if I take it out, hopefully without getting styrofoam on, on the floor, I can reach the thing. But as you can see, well, you can't see the camera's not pointing at it, is it? Ta-da! Well, not that, but I'll show you that in a second. Oh yeah, um, they probably don't watch this, obviously, because, I mean, there's no better things to do. But this is for my brother and friend for their Christmas present, because last year I started them with the uh, one trial deck each and one of the booster packs that have released each. So like, this is for one each, this is the, what, Opus um, 7, and this is for the Final Fantasy trading card game. I 
not really interested that that much in Final Fantasy, so I'm not going to open this for you, obviously. It's a Christmas present for a friend and a bro. Um, but, yeah, the this uh, Opus 7, I believe, is the newest released booster uh, expansion set. That, yeah, that just released, technically. As I already said, like, three times. But, uh, that's the art pack art for that, if you're interested. And, um, yeah. Not too interested in Final Fantasy as much. I like Final Fantasy uh, X-2, which is like 10 version 2, because it's the female version that are the main characters. So I've got 10 and 10-2 on for my PS3. But I think that's one of the main ones that I like. Because I have played some of Final Fantasy VII and some of, you know, some, some others, but... I think also based on the character, if I like it or not. But, well, you know. Anyway, so this... Because I've got, um, booster pack numbers, uh, six, maybe five? Or five came out last year. I can't remember, but, you know, this is number seven. So that will go over there. Anyway, the thing that I was showing you is this awesome lunchbox. Well, technically it's not a lunchbox, but, I mean, look at it. It's like a collector's chest? Treasure chest? So I have no idea what they call them these days. But they come with stickers. Ooh. Okay, um, and much more. Well, the and much more you can see on the side. So this is the lovely Pikachu and Eevee version. So you got Eevee on that side. You would have someone on that side, um, Pikachu on that side, obviously. <laughs> then you have the three legendary birds on the back. So basically, well, besides the styrofoam, Get off. Okay. That is so cool. I oh, wonder. No. Leave a comment below if you want. Uh, which is your favorite legendary bird? Um, hmm. Well, by the, the looks, like the aesthetically pleasing looking one, is Articuno, I think. The next up is Moltres that I like, because it's pretty cool, you know. I just don't like Spiky here. It just never really appealed to me, really. But anyway. <clears throat> you actually see what's inside here, but let me just uh, read it out to you. Pokemon treasure chest. A sturdy and metal case contains... Well, it's goodies, okay. Um, five booster packs, three foil promo cards featuring Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres, a coin, two colorful sticker sheets, blah, sticker sheets, a mini portfolio for... Um, to store your favorite cards. A notepad, four pencils, and a code card. I'm not sure what the code card's for. Is it for just the three promos? I don't know if they're promos or alternate arts, but... Yes. I hope that... They should be holographic. I hope so, anyway. So, obviously, the stickers would be the cover and the back. So, I never want to use the stickers because, like, you know, it's... It's using them, and I can't use them again after I use them, so I don't really want to use them again, you know? Because they're awesome. And I'm just like that. I'm like, like, I'm like that with notebooks, too. Like, I've got this Slytherin one. I don't want to use it because I, want, I don't want to mess it up, you know? Like, if I, ha if I bought two, then I'd use one. and keep the other one, like, sealed and stuff. But yeah. But obviously I don't keep uh, Pokemon TCG sealed because I can't. Yeah, I, I can't do that. It's just not possible. Okay, so, as you see in the back here, is this, what was it, Ghost Tricks Yeti or something? I've never been good at, well, I've never actually really collected a lot of Ghost Tricks Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I've got some, because they're pretty cute, but I don't have a lot. And, yeah, there's nothing else. Just styrofoam. Okay, so I'm gonna put these down here. 
so I can move the box back because it's in the way. Now, the question is, can I move the box back? Let's put this... So much brown paper, I'm gonna have to go and like, fold all of it. Okay. So just put that there. Put this here. You can't see it, but there we have it. Because like it's like that. I'm sorry, as you can might tell, I'm sort of setting this up for a picture. But so this is the back, obviously. I haven't actually bought very many Yu-Gi-Oh things. I'll have to get back to uh, getting some of the, my pack art thing. I'm trying to have like a pack art of every pack. Which is getting hard because I can't find the tournament, um, was it OST tournament pack number five. I'm pretty sure they come out with number six already or something, but I can't find number five, and it's, it's kind of annoying. It's probably just like a US thing, but I can't find number five. Because I've got number numbers one to four. Or is it number six I'm missing? I can't remember. Anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm jabbering on now. So this is the back. I have to hold this up now because I can't see it. It is a massive, massive. Advent calendar. Now, normally, I was like thinking if, like, iffy, iffy, whether I wanted to buy it or not. But I did watch Cyber Knight's thing of opening of it, and some of the, well, at least one or two of the cards I wanted, it was in it. Or a couple I wanted. And it had this guy in it, and he's so cute. Little Snowman Jack thing. Ghost Tricks. Uh, something. I really can't remember anymore. Okay, so as you can see, it says, whoops, Yu Gi Oh! Trading Card Game Admin Calendar. No. Here. I will do. Man, I, I hope I remember. If I don't, I will either do one video per line, you know, because it goes all the way up to 24. So there's one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. It goes up to 24 in each row. Well, this row has four. That row has five. That is five. That is five. That is five. So it'd be a one, two, three, four, five videos, or should I do little mini videos per opening to have an actual video a day in December? Hmm. Tuffy, Tuffy. Why don't you leave a comment down below what you think? Because uh, I don't know. I do not know what to do. So, I guess you could call this like a viewer's choice. So tell me, do you want a video a day for this advent calendar? Or would you like the video a week? Okay, well, not really a week, but every four or five days. Like on the 4th, 9th, 14th, 19th, and 24th. Or one a day. But please leave a comment below because I'm not really sure. I might ask this on Instagram too, I'm not sure, but... I'd have to remember to put it on Instagram first. <laughs> so I'm not sure. So... Well... Yeah, I'm not sure. So please leave a comment below and tell me, because I have no idea. Yeah. Okay. Uh, 
So let me just move this along so I can take my picture. Oh, poo. What did I drop now? Ugh. Yeah. Okay. I'm still waiting on that Harry Potter Funko Pop. The advent calendar. My order still says processing. So I hope it comes. Because, like, it'd really be a bummer if it doesn't, you know? Because I did pre order it for a while, and that's on the. I want one of those.com, so hopefully it shows. But, anyway, I thought, you know, might as well, because there was this. I'm talking about something else now. But this is a. This was a huge box, and I thought, you know, why don't I open it? And also brings up the hive, of, and you see what videos are coming up. I do, still do. Nah. Mm. I still do have a, a Celestial Storm 3-pack blister featuring the uh, Tapu Kogo promo, or alternate, I have no idea what it is, I'll just say promo, um, that 3-pack blister and both of the Check Lane 1-pack blisters. I set them aside, if anyone wants to do a pack battle with me with those, be my guest. That should be fun. I've only done one pack battle and it was with the God and Collect Mall. So, and you've probably seen how that ended. Hmm. <laughs> Mine wasn't very good. Hopefully this next one would be. So, if you want to do a pack battle with me, send me a message on my email below. In the description box. Because that uh, Gmail I specifically made for YouTube stuff. Also because of the amount of YouTube notifications that would have, like, invaded my Hotmail would have been catastrophic since I still have about 3,000 videos to watch. Or so. So, um, I'm kind of behind. So, um, yeah. I I've got a lot of watching to do and I don't, like, every day I don't feel like watching videos non-stop every day. I got other things to do, so. And also, half the reason why it's all blocked up is because, like, when I was sick, then obviously, like, well, certain times when I'm sick, if it's for a certain reason, then obviously I don't look at a screen because then I get a headache and blah, blah. Yes, anyway, so, yes, this is the awesome Chaos Cards haul, which I... Yeah. Though, for a haul, there's only technically four things. So technically, uh, one, two, three, four, five, and a half. Which just kind of says one. So five things, technically. Though, what I open would be four. But, oh, I have to wrap those now. Then I have to get around to actually going to my brother, because he moved out. Um, but yeah. So, next on my list to buy would be, <laughs> well, probably actually should be the Dragon Majesty Elite Trainer Box. Because I still need to do that, and I still need to buy the Forbidden Light Booster Box. And now, all of the Lost Thunder, like, Check Lane Blisters, ZTB Booster Box, and obviously 3 pack Blisters. Then obviously the other Dragon Majesty collection boxes, like with the Dragon Knight in it, and the, there's the Nova collection box, and there's some other... I'm really behind. I've been spending a lot on Instagram, so... Yeah, I get sidetracked a lot. Which shows, because this is, well, this is like 24 minutes, and my battery's running low anyway, so... That's a good cue to uh, end this video. So... Thank you for watching. Look forward to me opening all these lovely goodies. Uh, like and subscribe for more. Ring the doorbell for notifications. Over and out.